What's up ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to Smart Tech. Today we're taking a look at increasing your productivity. Today's video is brought to you guys by Detach who are going to be helping with that particular goal. Now, as you guys know, there could be attachments spread all throughout your email and sometimes we just need to find that one particular Word document or important file that was in that random email that we kind of remember but we don't actually remember. So we spend hours and hours searching for that one attachment that we lost. Instead, what if I told you there was an extension that could do all that work for you? Well, it's known as detach so you can actually detach yourself from all those attachments now as you guys can see this allows you to directly search from the gmail bar for all your different attachments and as you guys can see right here it actually allows you to filter all of those different files uh, based on what they are for example pictures they could be docs pdfs movies and even music from there on out you can actually go and forward print or share those attachments it's totally safe and that's because they will not read or look at any of the attachments you actually uh, mess with in this case they simply help you search for them and as you guys can see they have some pretty top-notch reviews so we're actually gonna go ahead and get started with detach when you first go ahead and get it for Gmail you have to go through this mini little tutorial in this case you have to sign in Gmail so I'm gonna do that real quick now I'm not too too worried about you guys reading these emails this is of course my spam email now just a random side note for all you guys who don't have a spam email please make one as you guys can see I have 4,500 in this email and I made it for all the random brands that I kind of sign up for that I'm kind of iffy about whether they're gonna spam me or not and clearly I am correct as to whether they're gonna spam me because as you can see here there's almost 5,000 and I made this only around six or seven months ago so that's absolutely insane now there's everything from Chili's to Target here so I'm sure at least one of these has an attachment built into it. So as you can see, there's a massive detached settings icon right here. And for now, it is actually analyzing my emails, trying to find all those attachments and preparing my feed. So for now, I'm actually going to let that do that. We're going to go back to it after it is done. So as you guys can see right here, it gives me a cool little tutorial. This is your detached feed. So right there. These are all the different attachments that I've messed with. Oh, look, we got Obama in there. And next off, we got ourselves file filters. So of course, I have one other, seven photos, one document, a few PDFs, movies, and well, not a few PDFs, movies, and music. Now next off, we also got ourselves the date scroller. So if you're trying to look for certain things that are really, really old or maybe really, really new, then of course, this is a perfect way to do so. Next off, this circle changes the view. So of course, we can actually make it bigger, smaller, larger, depending on what we wish to do and how we want the detach extension to look like. Now, next off, as you guys can see, the search bar will also search for your files. So if you're looking for, I don't know, maybe we'll look for more rock. And as you can see, there you go. And it extension allows us to automatically search for attachments and Obama pops up. How cool is that? Next off, it also can include full contents, file types, or email addresses. So I can go ahead and maybe search .mp3 in here. Obviously, I don't have any mp3 files in here, but if I were to, then this would be an awesome way to go and find that in less than a few seconds. That's about it, guys. It's really, really simple and it works really, really well. Now, you guys might be wondering, what do you do after you found Obama? Well, as you guys can see I'm gonna click Obama real quick I can actually go ahead and check out his face right here but if I want to go and view the actual email that this was from I can go do that as well so this is a really really old conversation with a buddy of mine but afterwards he did happen to send me this picture of Obama and now maybe I want to forward Obama's face to someone or maybe better yet I might want to download Obama's face so in that case I can easily go ahead and do that let's go ahead and forward this to him even though these are ages old and we should be perfectly set to go overall guys i'd say this works really really well it's very 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 simple it gets the job done and it will probably save you guys a lot of time now obviously this is my spam email there aren't too too many attachments in here this is the email i use for making videos but if i were using my official youtube email there are thousands upon thousands of attachments in there ranging from docs to payment processing information to photos to videos to pr documents all of that compiled can drive me insane sometimes when I'm looking for one tiny little signed document. In this case, this would make my life a thousand times easier. It's not something I'm just recommending to you guys. It is something I started using and I'm actually really happy that I found these guys and I found the guys and then of course I downloaded their extension and I was like, whoa, 
this would be awesome to make a video on because you know this is probably going to help out a lot of people who are working and it might just help you find some old photos that you have stuck in your email that you may not have known still exist on all guys hopefully you enjoyed this video if so leave a like and don't forget to subscribe thank you guys for watching this is going to be me logging off